with Roglic not starting stage 17 following his crash on stage 16, and with Uram taking the win from the break, and this way riding back into the top 10, here's the GC going into stage 80. Mats did not add to his tally on stage 17, there's now 200 points between him and Wright, with a maximum of 200 points to be scored till Madrid. So can we please get Mats a green bike? Nothing changed amongst the Polkadot jersey contenders. And stage 18 is a 192k mountain stage from Trujillo to Alto de Piornal, which gets climbed from both sides, cresting a first time with about 40k to go, followed by a roughly 20k descent, and then straight back up the other side of the first category climb to the finish. From both sides, the climb is 13.5k, averages 5%, and never gets really steep. Here's the stage shots at the time of recording, with Carapaz, Pino and Vine as the favorites for the stage. Also on my end, I'm again leaning towards a breakaway. Jay Vine and Carapaz both lost time today, for which I can only think of one reason, having a margin to be safely allowed into the break. Marc Soler at UAE has been in most, if not all, breaks of this Vuelta, so I expect him to get in there once more. Then I'm expecting Jumbo Visma to try and honor Roglic with a stage win. These climbs would normally suit Rohan Dennis, yet based on performances in this Vuelta, I think it will have to come from Chris Harper. Other riders who will be allowed in the break, who've been active before and who should do well on climbs with these type of gradients are Kelderman at Bora, Luis Leon Sanchez at Bahrain, Reichenbach at Grupama and Carlos Canal at Escaltel. I'm also expecting Padun at EF and Batistella at Astana to have marked this stage. In terms of stars for stage 18 of this year's Vuelta, I'm giving four stars to Vine and Carapaz, three stars to Soler and Harper, two stars for Kelderman Sanchez, Padun and Batistella, and one star for Reichenbach and Canal. In terms of podium prediction for stage 18 of the 2022 Vuelta a España, I'm going for a third win by Carapaz ahead of Fine and Harper. Thanks for watching, leave your thoughts in the comments below, like and subscribe, and see you tomorrow.